Hello everybody, welcome back to the Kerbal Space Program. My name is Chris and this is Subscriber Designs episode 33. Today we will start off with a craft which is very unusual. It is not an aircraft, it is a Hot Wheels track. And I've only tested this once and this is made by Lava Master. He's actually submitted a few designs recently that I've glanced over. But this thing is big. <laughs> Uh, very unusual. We'll just jump into it. The first time I tested it, I did it completely wrong. Because I didn't bother reading the instructions, as per usual. But we will actually just jump straight in to the cockpit. I think, I don't even know if we're meant to do SAS or not. I'm going to do it. Uh, we are going to spacebar. Those engines down there turn on. Uh, decouple. Okay. Nope. 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 Yep. Nope. 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 No. <laughs> oh no. Okay, that's strange. We're meant to turn those engines on. Oh. Uh huh. Oh. <laughs> okay. I think we did something wrong. It's in a very unusual position now. The engines. How exciting. Alright, now let's read the instructions. Okay, put thrust to max and activate the engines at the end of the track. Okay, detach car, then switch to it. Aha. Uh -huh. That was our problem. We switched to it at the beginning. That was wrong. Let's do that again. Okay. Let's, let's have the brakes on, because why not? Do that. That's at full throttle. Okay. Spacebar. That's detached. Um, switch over to it. So now we control it. Let's go. It's still attached, I believe. Okay. Let's click C. Spacebar. I said spacebar. Whoa. Okay. Was not meant to go full throttle. Was not meant to do that. All right, let's see if we can adjust. Nope, that's a problem. Now we use a bit of thrust. Nope, all right, we're stuck. How exciting. Let's try that again. We have control, brakes off, throttle down, very down. If we turn, turn that off, what's that? Oh, okay, full throttle. I think we're doing it. And... <laughs> I did not expect that. Okay, this is a Hot Wheels track. Indeed, now it's meant to crash. Ooh, we should be able to land it. <laughs> Maybe not. Doesn't say anything about landing. Nope. Nothing about landing. Oh, no control. Alright, let's fly it like this. Nope, that doesn't help. Alright, we have no control. Oh, it's very small. It's a very small craft, but a lack of control. We need like an SAS module of some sort. But okay, that was that worked out well. <laughs> Let's move on to the next design. Something that may be an actual craft, an aircraft of some sort. All right, the next craft is by Mag, and it is known as Whale of the Sky. I believe he has misspelled it there, unless he means something else. But this is a whale for reasons beyond me. Two engines, what type of engines? Good old ramjet engines. Uh, you know this new update that came out for KSP, I barely looked at it. There's like a few new engines. I did test out this engine here. I do like it. Uh, I do like it a lot actually. And we do have this tiny engine now. Look at that basic gen engine. It's just so small. It's amazing. Like if you were compare that, compare that with the average engine, is it's quite a difference in size. I'm quite fond of it. Very good. At least it allows for a multitude of crafts to be created now with a smaller engine. Yay! All right, let's jump to it. So, there are instructions, uh, at the very least, you can turn on the lights, it has lights, 
This was made for a previous version of KSP. Oh. Oh, yeah, 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 I like it. Yeah, it's good. I like the color of light. All right, it's a good choice. Uh, sometimes red, no, no, what color was it? Red and sort of like, like an orangey color. They work well in this game. All right, F3, yeah, there we go. <laughs> I knew that was gonna happen. Engine heated by engine exhaust. Yes, and that is preventing us from accelerating. Got all that energy just being bombarded onto these wings here. And, oh, when I click any button to move, I move. But when I don't, we slow down. Wow, this is not bad at gliding. Let's just hold down spacebar. Spacebar does nothing. <laughs> Why did I say spacebar? Man, this thing moves so slow. Alright. Alright, let's click W. No, W doesn't work. But S does. I mean, that's when it comes to helping us accelerate. Which is not bad with doing that. The way to fix the issue would be... Oh, we're actually going to make that. Wow, look at that. That's not bad. Not bad at all. Oh, here we go. Crash, crash. What? <laughs> Alright, well the next one's going to be a crash. For sure, right? Yes, okay. <laughs> but damn, that was surprisingly good. I mean, obviously you do need to fix the issue of... The engine just putting all that energy onto the wings here. You'd have to adjust, perhaps, this wing here would have to go. This one as well. This back one here as well. And then it's pretty much nice and open then. Uh, let's, let's actually test that out. I want to see if it fixes it, which it should have. Uh, let's use the, just normal, normal wheel. Like that. Uh, okay, that should do it. Here we go. Full throttle and there we go. Problem solved. Doesn't look as good as it did before. Oh, actually, doesn't look too bad. <laughs> but will it work? Oh, uh, no, uh, things are not working as well as they were before. Okay, it looks like the uh, the center of lift needs moving a bit. But regardless, the craft is working a little bit better than before. Yeah, it still needs a bit of work. Well, that's up to you guys. You guys can work on it yourselves. Wow, that's that kind of looks cool when that moves. Ooh. Tail fin, eh? Alright, well, it is a whale. It shouldn't really... Technically, it shouldn't be this uh, maneuverable. <laughs> Alright, let's uh, proceed on to the next craft. The final craft for this episode is X-Wing, and this is made by Retrobit Gamer. For this to work, you do need to activate your cheats, because it is intended to be flown in space. Uh, originally, the design had a few flaws, such as the wheels being incorrectly placed. In fact, I still need to fix that up a bit. Uh, there was a way to do it. But anyway, that, that generally works. Okay, it's better than before. Uh, we do have some nice looking parts here. The way that these solar panels have been placed, that's for aesthetics as well as this nose cone here, I believe all this stuff was really just to look like the real X-Wing. And we do have these that are meant to be some form of lasers, I assume. Or missiles. Yeah, definitely lasers. Uh, you could use a laser mod in KSP and just plop one, a few down on the sides. And that would actually work. Okay, here we go. I'm gonna do... Alt F12, we got infinite fuel, 
and gravity's been hacked yes because i was testing this out before all right let's go we try not to break anything yada, yada, yada. i just want to get into space because in atmosphere this does not work well at all pop and a pop all right there we go <laughs> just activate the bonus engines anyway oh that actually looks good Ew, very nice. Wow, what happened to the... Did I press space up by accident before? What happened here? Oh, it says unsafe. Oh, and then it's red. Oh, that's an interesting feature. Yeah, uh, as you can probably tell, I haven't played KSP for a while. Taking a break. And I'm back. A few new parts introduced, but generally speaking, the game's still the same. That's so upsetting. Alright, I know the, the gravity is still hacked. Just wait until we get... Whoa, okay, that was... That's bad. Don't worry. I will fix it. There we go. Yeah, it's good. And back into action. We... <laughs> yes, alright, we will get into orbit. That is very good. Let's go like that. We've got two Kerbals in this cockpit. Wow, this is shaking a bit, isn't it? Ooh. That's interesting. Is that a new feature? I don't remember it shaking so much. <laughs> Who knows? Time up. I just go for a big orbit. Why not? Time up. Ah, I'm sick of the slow time up. Wait, we could... What was that feature again where we could just automatically time up? Warp here. Ah, oh, that's amazing. Oh, I completely forgot about that. That is good. That saves so much time. It's incredible. It is amazing. And... Yeah, okay, very good. I don't really care about fuel because obviously we're using cheats, so fuel isn't an issue. But we have gotten into space successfully. Do we even have hyper edit? Nope, don't have hyper edit. Could have used hyper edit to get into space. But I'll have to install that later on. For future testing. But yeah, here we go. Success. In fact, I might as well fly it around in space in first person. We'll see how it goes. I'm sure we'll do well. I do have a new graphics card at the moment, the GTX 980 Ti, and I'll tell you what, the frame rate in game is, well, still pretty bad. <laughs> still not happy with that, but alright, it's a game, we play it, so we have to deal with it. Alright, first person, here we go. Ooh, that kind of looks different. Was it, did it always look like that? Yeah, oh. Alright, because I don't remember looking inside this cockpit. What the? What? What was that? What am I hearing? <laughs> oh, what? What's with these Kerbals? Since when did they move? I don't remember that. That must be a new feature. Because these Kerbals, man, they, they don't move. I mean, the camera here moves, but that's strange. All right, I'm not used to that. It's freaky. These things are alive. <laughs> All right. Oh, we gotta go back here. All right, let's do this. Oh, we're so gonna go straight to the planet. Uh, with Frato. Oh, oh, it's starting to shake. Oh yeah, I remember the shaking now. With that new heat introduction to game all right what are we looking at yeah uh, do we have here we go <laughs> there's no way to look at it all right we need to burn that that's good very good doing everything in first person it's freaky oh my god we're still going Alright, it's good. Alright, we're still going backwards. 
Okay, I'm really not used to this. Well, what is that? That's bugged. Click C. What? The. What is going on? All right, that was strange. Oh, I see where we are. We should really reposition. All right, let's point that way. Yeah, am I doing it right? Uh, you guys are getting sick right now, eh? I'm sorry. Whoa. Something's gonna explode, I'm telling you. Probably. I guess we got. Whoa. That is scary. That's very scary. Whoa. Man, this is freaky. I've never been like this before. Whoa. <laughs> I actually enjoyed that. Nice. Very good. That was enjoyable. Alright. <laughs> I think uh, we can end this episode here, guys. So, I would like to thank the subscribers for your submissions. That is Mag for submitting Whale of the Sky. X-Plane, which was submitted by Retrobit Gamer. And I'd also like to thank Lava Master for the Hot Wheels track. Thank you for watching and see you next time.